this is a really new and exciting venture for me. And I owe a lot to my director, Peter Adams, because it was his idea to call it The Importance of Being Miriam, which I think was a bit cheeky, and I hope people don't find it uh, rather conceited. But what I wanted to do was to look back on my life and my career and to share with an audience the thrills that I have had in reading and performing. And I'm doing it with John Martin. Because I've done Dickens' Women around the world, people always expect me to want to do one-person shows. And I was determined that I would not do another one-person show. I wanted a chap with me on the stage. And who better to have than John Martin, who has been my pianist whenever I've been in Australia. And I just love him. I just love being with him. I love his sense of humour. His range musically is enormous. And he's got a lovely singing voice, which I do not have. So that's one of the reasons that I'm thrilled to have him. I'm always being asked, who is my favourite character? Well, that's very hard because there are so many. So I've chosen the literary figures that I have always wanted to play, like Lady Bracknell and Mrs Malaprop. I played Miss Prism and she might peep in there as well. And I've also loved the reading that I've done and so I want to include some of the important literary characters that I enjoy reading and enjoy speaking aloud. And of course, Dickens will be primarily among them. So there will be a variety of characters in different accents, because that's one of the things I do well, is change my voice. And I love doing that, love. And I can, you know, go up and down the social scale, because you've got to try that, haven't you? You can't always talk posh, drives people mad. Another thing that people always ask is, what are you actually doing? Is it a comedy, a tragedy? Is it farce? Well, this piece, The Importance of Being Miriam, is everything. There isn't a consistent style to it. It's a medley, uh, a, a daring medley, perhaps, because I like to juxtapose the funny and the sad, because that's life and what I want to bring to the theatre and to the audiences is life and truth as shown in literature, in poetry, prose and music. So what you can expect from this show, The Importance of Being Miriam, is new things and old things uh, I'm the old thing, and uh, lots of laughs and fun and conversations with the audience. Because I've been on lots of television chat shows and I've said some terribly rude things on them, which I shan't do in the theatre. Well, I don't know, I might. But it's just lovely to meet people and, and talk to them. So it's going to be an incredible mixture and it's going to be daring and funny and sometimes moving and sad. And I'm going to give as much as I can and I, I know that it'll be worth it.